Hi guys! In this video, we will feature Crypto Gods, which is similar to Crypto Mines in a way that they both have the concept of Oracle. Now, what is an Oracle and what is the advantage if there is an Oracle in the features of the game? Well, the Oracle guys can give every player an equal opportunity to start in the game, okay? So, walang nauuna at tahuhuli dito guys, kasi equal no, or parehas na yung entry cost nila. Doesn't matter kung after one year ka pa mag mag-invest dito kasi nga naka-oracle siya. Okay, mag-a-adjust yung, yung price ng token. Okay, let me give you an example. Yung entry dito ni, ni CryptoGuys is kailangan mo ng 2,000 na token. Okay, 2,000 na token which is equivalent to 2,000 pesos. Let's just say that that is our example. Okay, tapos guys, itong si CryptoGuys mag-base siya doon sa stable na price, okay, or sa stable na currency, which is the peso. So, kung 2,000 peso talaga yung kanilang entry cost, doon sila mag-base. Okay, this hindi sila mag-base doon sa token nila na gods, okay, because gods is their main token here. So, kung yung gods, guys, is equivalent to 1 peso, so kakailanganin mo ng 2,000 gods para makuha mo yung entry cost sa 2,000 pesos. Pero, kapag yung gods token ay naging 5 peso siya, kakailanganin mo na lang, guys, ng 400 na gods token, which is equivalent this time to still 2,000 pesos. At kapag naging 10 pesos, guys, yung gods token, mag adjust na naman yung token, yung required amount, amount of gods token for you to start. So, kailangan 2,000 pa rin yung, yung kanyang equivalence. Okay, so... Ganun yung concept ng Oracle. So, mag-a-address yung token mismo, guys, yung main currency nila, para lang makip niya yung stable price na 2,000 pesos. And also, guys, according sa team naman, gusto nila na yung maging entry cost ng crypto gods is only 2,000 pesos. So, hopefully, guys, 2,000 pesos talaga yung kanyang entry cost. So, that's the beauty, guys, of having an Oracle in an NFT game. So this time we will try check out guys their website and also their white paper. And anyway, this is Professor T-Rex and welcome to my YouTube channel. Crypto Gods is having their pre-sale at the moment and all you have to do is just click this part of their website and you'll be redirected to this site wherein you can participate of their pre-sale. So hard cap is 150 BNB, soft cap is 75 and then the maximum amount of BNB that you can contribute here is 5 BNB and there's no minimum guys and there are 74 million gods in supply and only 7% is allocated on this pre-sale. Okay, and remaining supply that we have at the moment for the pre-sale is only 2 million and 994. guys one day four hours and 56 minutes left so you can still participate on their pre-sale if you want and also guys are going to launch their game this month of november they've developed already 60 percent of their game so hopefully by november everything will be launched for the public also guys their gameplay is inspired by the dota 2 the game if you are a player or if you have been playing dota 2 then this is the moment wherein you can apply your skills here in the nft game na crypto gods okay so if you're interested guys to participate on our pre-sale yeah you cannot participate anytime you want okay and also guys before we we proceed yeah. ito yung kanilang white paper and one of the major things that like, i would look into a project is the team okay and after the team the partners investors backers and so on so ito yung team guys and as you can see they are docs naman they are transparent i've talked with nathan already anyway hello to nathan and also shout out then kay ken na 
bumili, kakabili niya lang guys ng God's token kasi nga na-introduce ko itong crypto God sa kanya. So ayan, shout out sa iyo. <laughs> anyway, so ayan si Nathan, ito siya nakilala ko na siya, nakausap ko siya. And Mark Go, ayan Marvin Chai, ayan no. So far, they are ano naman guys, transparent. Eh saka ito si Nick. Si Nick aside from being a CEO or founder of Crypto Gods, he's also the founder of this one, itong uh Ecom Empire. So, ito yung kanyang book, guys. Nick Peroni. That's his full name. And then, ayan. Ito naman siya. He's a very big guy. Like, not literally big guy. But he has a big name in the industry. So, nasa e-commerce siya, guys. Ayan. So, isa siyang mentor, no? So, ayan. <laughs> Just wanna share with you. So, that's Nick, the founder. So, this time, let's check, guys, the different features of their game. Ayan, Crypto God is a Dota 2 inspired P2E NFT universe. Ayan, kakashat lang ni Ken. <laughs> Ayan. Okay. And it has the capability to earn tokens while playing and contributing to the game's ecosystem. Players can own Crypto God's sense, non fungible 3D characters, so sense yung tawa dito to play combat. Morph, hone, collect, and build an army of volleyball crypto assets. So, yan yung kanila mga NFT, guys. 3D siya, so medyo challenging din to. So, here, players can earn by unlocking ancient stones and get a chance of receiving high rarity sense, playing combat to slay ombras, and fight sense duels in return, earning cryptocurrency tokens as game rewards, opening treasure chests to receive ancient stones, god tokens, and sense items, selling treasure chests rewards in the marketplace, Collecting and speculating on rare sense such as crystal, shadow, and holy sense. Farming gods tokens and trinity keys, which are required in acquiring treasure chests. The gods tokens is cryptocurrency token and can be sold on the centralized exchanges such as Uniswap and PancakeSwap. And then players can earn our token, gods tokens, which holds part of the game. And players holding gods token will be part of owner, will be part owner of the game. So that's what we receive generous game incentives. So yung mga aabangan natin as players. Actually, marami-rami din siya, no? Ayan. And then, remission is to continuous with solve fundamental problems arising in the NFT game fight scene, converting them into investment opportunities, helping investors looking for safe and sound earning models. Actually, yung isa sa mga founders nito, eh, <laughs> nabiktima rin ni P2E, ni Plan to Earn, ni Fusion Heroes, at saka ni Demon. That's why, guys, ano talaga, they, they decided to really develop an NFT game wherein they try to address no, kung ano ba yung mga problema sa mga previous na games and they try to avoid those coming up with these different features. Anyway, wait pa. So their vision is to provide a stable and balanced earning avenues in the world full of disappointing NFT game by the centralized apps. Ramdam na ramdam ko yan. <laughs> Kasi ako rin, I've been a victim talaga of yung nga, mga paasa ng mga NFT game. So, let's talk about this time their characters. Ayan, sense yung tao sa kanilang characters. Okay, and these are the different rarity. Ancient, Awakened, Hermit, Mystic, Ether, Demigod, and Immortal. And then Daily Combat Spirits. Okay. Tapos, Ancient Stones. Okay, so, to start playing Crypto Gods, you first need to acquire a sense character. You can buy the Ancient Stones from the Gods shop and transmute it to a sense. So, stone muna yung mabibili mo sa shop. You can also directly buy the cents on the marketplace. Ayan. Pwede rin naman siya. And the price of an ancient stone is 2,000 gods token. So, kung piso yung isang 2,000... So, kung piso yung isang gods token nila, guys, then that's 2,000 pesos. Buying ancient stones may have the chance of acquiring a much more rare and valuable set. So, that's why most of the players prefer talaga yung mga mystery boxes na because there is a chance for us to get a higher rarity of NFTs. Unlock the ancient stones through transmutation and turn them into crypto god sense characters. Ito yung kanilang token address, guys, so you have to be very careful with the scam tokens online. And then sense combat, ayan, meron silang daily quest, may slay ombras, sense duel, ayan. And oracle-based yung kanilang gameplay. So na-explain ko na kanina, and this became possible because of chain link. Ayan. <laughs> and then treasure chest, you can also unlock here treasure chests, guys. Ancient chest, crystal chest, shadow chest, and holy chest. So these chests uh, contain rewards such as random ancient stone, 1% percent yung kanyang chance, god tokens, god's tokens, and uncommon or legendary items. Yeah, so at least, diba, 
Meron ka makukuha mga treasure chest. So, how are you going to get a treasure chest? You will need one Trinity key. So, kailangan mong maghanap ng item na to. And then, 1,000 God's token naman. Okay. And then, we have here God's token staking. So, there will be staking also here. So, Crypto God's Treasury allows the staking of God's tokens. Staking rewards players for contributing in the game economy by locking up their God's tokens and supporting Crypto God's in the long term. Players staking for God's token will earn God's token as rewards, which will be taken from the God's shop's uh, God's token revenue. And in the future, staking God's token will give you rights to participate on Crypto God's governance contract and influence usage of the treasury holdings. So very common on no? the feature of a staking uh, pro, uh, ano, feature. And then God's token. So this is the name Crypto God's token or God's in kanyang symbol. And there are only 74 million guys. Ha, supply. Mababa yung kanyang supply. No? So this is the distribution and unlocking. So if you if you've invested on the seed sale, so 5% will be released. I mean, no, 5% is allocated for the seed sale rather and unlocks 20% per month. And then for the pre-sale, and 7% siya makes lock or unlock siya, no? And then public sale, unlock siya. And then LP liquidity locked for one year. Then utilities. So purchase sense, so ancient chest reward, crypto good central bank, mining reward. Meron siyang central bank dito or treasury marketplace currency, sense fusion requirement, and boss dungeon requirement. So, yeah, may boss dungeon siya guys sa kanilang gameplay. So, okay, no mix. Ayan, so economic pillars nila. We have the investors, players, game universe, crypto gods, treasury, and the DX or CX open market. And the deflationary yung kanya token guys. So, bababa ng bababa yung token supply nila. So, gods accumulated from the gods shop treasure chests revenue will be fully burned by 100%. Gods from morphing fees will be totally burned din siya. And 5% of gods fees from every transaction in the marketplace and will be distributed equally to the crypto gods OPEX and other channels. I don't know what this OPEX is. Okay. So, may dalawang mechanisms yung kanilang token. Okay. So, Roadmap nila guys, ayun nga, phase 1, pre-sale, public IPO, tapos launching on pancake swap, public launch P2E, public launch again P2E, ayan, phase 2, CX listing, and so on. And so, no, magkakaroon sila ng Android and iOS versions. And then, I don't know what this revenue streams. Crypto gods will take revenue from the following transaction streams. Commission fee of 5% from the gods shop's revenues. Okay. Commission fee of 5% for each market, marketplace gods token transactions. And in the future, they could start selling in-game upgrades ranging from aesthetic skins. Oh, my skins, guys. So, item skills and consumables. And then the third treasury will be accumulating 95% of the revenues to be distributed as taking rewards. So, dito kukunin, guys, yung rewards ng mga nag-stake. In the future, the treasury will be fully owned and governed by the community of God's token stakers. Ayan. So, yun lang muna, guys, yung mga basic information about crypto gods. So, that's it overall, guys. I, I find this NFT game promising dahil sa kanilang oracle nga. So, hindi mo kailangang mag-alala kung nahuli ka. Okay? Hindi, hindi siya paunahan. No? Tsaka, yun nga, stable yung kanyang entry cost. Which was also the main reason, guys, why I want to invest on this game. Well, that's it about Crypto Gods. If you want to know more and get updated, guys, about their upcoming events and also the development of their game, all you have to do is just to connect to their different channels. Okay. So they have their Telegram, Twitter, Facebook, Discord, and also YouTube. So just check the description box, guys, of this video for you to see the links of their community. Okay, thank you so much guys for watching and also don't forget guys, another promising NFT game, fully audited sila guys, KYC and verified Battle Mons NFT game. Okay, thank you so much guys for watching and have a great day everyone. Bye!